Hello again. Hello, hello. Episode four. We want to go to uh, Tur Temple. Tell us about Tur Temple. It's the tur 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 Temple. Turtle. It's the uh, Temple of the Turtles. Is this some sort of like a uh, pagan turtle god? I suppose. Do we get to meet the tur the pagan god? No. Do we get to see statues of this turtle god? Uh, actually, yes. Really? Are they? Well, are not they... really. Sad. It's, it's like a it's like a face. I guess really? I don't know. So does uh. Do the, do the rabbit people, whatever uh, jazz, whatever race Jazz Jacko is from, do they worship a rabbit god? I'm sorry. I, I wish I had all the answers. I didn't well, there's know. that one guy in the thread who was telling me all about like the the, 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 the strategic purpose of the... the oh, oh, yeah, the, uh, Yeah, and the... Uh, um, you know, I, you I must know. know. And, and that this is all this is all in the Andromeda Galaxy, apparently. I didn't know that either. Right? Was it, is, that, is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. Yeah. The um. <laughs> I unfortunately don't know a whole lot about the jazz cannon. Really? I know. I just play the games. What, what are like those things? Like, uh, huh? What those things are collecting? They look like hairy hair, like carrots with <laughs> with long white hair. Not what they are. <laughs> yeah, that's probably exactly. Oh what no, that's ice cream. <laughs> ice cream. That's ice cream? Yeah. It's like an ice cream. I disagree. I sure see it back. This game is too fast! <laughs> yeah, oh, okay, nice. Yeah, see? Uh, it's really like, okay, I it's guess like it's like really, really melty, yeah. yeah. Well, they're in a desert. Fair point. So these, the, these, these boulders don't hurt you at all when they hit you? Uh, no, they just, you just ride around. around. Like, yeah, you ride on them. That's handy. There's already some action going on up there. Yeah. Um, a couple of these really goofy uh, um, blaster guys, because they just kind of like a couple of their... I suppose they have some kind of goofy backstory as well. Maybe, I don't know. But that's that guy. They're the acolytes of the turtle god. I guess, yeah. These other um, statues of uh, turtles holding blasters. Yeah, they must have been erected relatively recently. Maybe they're statues of the guys, like, the, the, we saw that earlier in the level. Maybe they're just statues of the guys we saw later in the level. Could be. Maybe. He's not a very good guard. He wouldn't have no. shot you if you just ran under him. That's a good point. The Acolytes of the Turtle God don't have their job very seriously, do they? No. It's the Turtle of the... Oh, okay. It's the Turtle of the Temple. Uh, or... Temple of the turtle. The turtle. The turtle. The turtle. 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 You kill the you kill the younglings. Is that stuff in the background? Lava. I I suppose yeah. This is just one of those. That's a uh, sacramental wine. The one of turtle Jesus flying. Yeah. Over. Sweet. Grab the airboard. The kicking rat airboard. With the little like resistor code on the side. Or, oh yeah. Whatever that is. A little preview of Jazz Jack Rabbit 3. A sign of things to come. Jazz Jack Rabbit 3. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know, I mean, this is probably discussion for the Jazz 3 video, but I'm really shocked that the game hasn't just been completed. It's, uh, it, was, it was never released, was it, the source? Uh, the source? No. Okay. What a shame. Yeah. I mean, it may as well, it may as well be released, right? Probably not. That's probably true also. Yeah, I, I, I know they don't have a jazz news source. Remember our... How does stuff like that get lost? I, guess, I mean, I guess we're kind of spoiled now in the days of, like, online... Well, even back then there was, like, online version control and stuff. Yeah. Distributed version control. You'd think someone would have a copy. From what I understand, uh, there, I, I listened to an interview with uh, Cliff Blazinski uh, years ago, and, he said, and they, they actually asked him about the jazz news source. He's like, I don't know, oh, are yeah, it hasn't been kept out of R.E.M. 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 Oh, oh, okay. That's like R.E.M. Like, oh, yeah. No. Well, they were working on a tribute album. So. <laughs> oh, a cityscape. Yeah. I really like the bonus uh, stages. What does the cityscape have to do with, like, the desert? I mean, what, didn't the, didn't I the... Know. Wasn't it supposed to be, like, an outdoorsy kind of... 
world, and the, aren't the, what, what are the other two in there? I guess we'll see. Yeah, there's uh, Nippius and uh, Jungle Brown. That's right. So we, we have, you know, the city, which is just kind of weird. We saw something kind of the opposite um, in episode two, where we had uh, Letney and Technoir. Right. And we got... Like Desert. Yeah, those Desert. And then maybe they just mixed them up. Well... Didn't they? Didn't they mix up the the episode preview also? Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Nippius. Nippius. The Nipple oh, planet. planet. Yeah. I love this little thing. Death freeze. That's good. That's good. Like, oh, right. nice. Those snowmen look horrifying. They're pretty. Oh, look at their look at look at that. They're like. Oh, I can't look at it. Gotta get every candy cane. Every one. I'll see you slide around the world. Wow, wow, wow. Penguins? Yeah. Penguin. Skiing penguins. Yeah, skiing or penguins skating with, penguins. With cool shades. Look at those shades. Well, that's smart, you know. It's uh, yeah. easy to get snow blindness and presumably on FPS. Unless it's always this dark. It could be. I, I, I imagine that this is like day for Nipheus. I don't know. Maybe that's why it's so cold. It's Maybe. Much sun. Is there? Do we know? Like, are the three the three planets from each from each episode in the same system or something? Or is that is any mention made of that at all? No, I don't know. I'm sure, sure that guy. I wish I could. I wish I could remember the, the name of that that poster on the thread. Yeah. Yeah, I have to ask him a bunch of questions about jazz cannon. Yeah, he'll know. You know what? I should. I should. I should have. Actually, I'll probably do it uh, tonight. Is scan that the jazz manual, but it hasn't already been scanned by the time this video is up. I think someone posted it already. Oh really? Oh, I thought. I thought. Oh, really? I think so. I didn't see it. Could be wrong. We'll see. Now you're going to shield. Sweet. And then I immediately lose it by jumping on it. <laughs> well, that's right, you, do, you, do, you can't jump on enemies in this game. Oh, nope. yeah. Not Mario or Sonic. Sort of. You can jump on enemies in Jazz too, can't you? No. Oh, well, the sort of. Stomp. Yeah. yeah. Right, right. You get the butt stomp. Ah. Uh, power of butts. That, yes. I love the music in these games. This seems like a relatively yeah, it is good music. This seems like a relatively easy level, with there not being many anim actual like enemies. Around. Yeah. One of the things about enemies is that I don't know if you can really tell, but you slide around a lot. Right. Oh, it's just challenging platforming then. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. And I'm the um, you have the snow guys in the way, so like it's very easy to uh, to like not be able to control yourself, and you just slide into one of them. Uh. So that's that's the challenge that they have. They're, they just aren't there. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, I got confused. I took the wrong one. Yeah, it seems, it seems confusing to me, too, so I don't blame you. I was like, oh no, this isn't the LP version of the thing I'm doing, so... I can't do this. I'll take the one with the, um, little arrows, too. I'll do this little effect here. You can, like, see through it. Neat. Also, the snow and how it accumulates. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh. I guess I'll look out for in this episode. Does the toaster have a have a stronger effect on the um, snowman than other weapons? Probably it doesn't uh, appear I to. So, no. Well, my immersion is ruined. I don't even know why I'm using the toaster here. It's because it's cool. I guess. I actually like it the least. Really? Because yeah, it, does, it doesn't really like, do anything fancy like the RF missiles or the, the launcher. It just is bigger and faster. Yeah. It's useful, but it, it's, I don't know. I just Kills don't things know. better. That's why I like it. to me. Yeah. 
Well, I guess you can just circumvent it. Yeah. See it on, on on these uh, pillars in the background here. Yeah. yeah. You can see you can see the shimmering effect on the big uh, on those big blocks up there. Yeah, I see it. It's really hard to see. Yeah. Not really looking for it. Yeah. It's surprising they put so much effort into backgrounds on a game where everything's moving too fast to notice. Yeah. Although again, like kind of, I I don't know who did, who did the art for the, for the, these backgrounds, but. Uh, they, uh, they really could use work on their like fire effects. Is that like sort of like the rockets from the? Oh yeah, from uh, Scrap Rap. Yeah, and and then here we've got these. I don't know what they're supposed to be like torches on sconces or something, but they're just solid and they're flashing red and yellow. Yeah, I believe it was Nick Stadler who did the art for this, like the like the, the pixel art. Everything else is so high res and pretty looking, and then there's these just solid blocks of, of color. Maybe fire was Maybe. Yeah, because well, I, yeah. I imagine they want to do like the uh, the palette animation for it uh, instead of like like actual like different sprites. Right. Well, they could have. They probably could have done that and still have more than one color on it at a time. I I think that uh, this game is this game is probably is, is so old that fire itself was a relatively recent concept, so they were still trying to figure <laughs> out how to draw it. Doom was 93, I believe. Uh, I, I was kind of assuming, like, thinking that it's 94. Because that's when Doom 2 came out, I think. Ah, uh, that sounds right, yeah. I was actually doing some research on this as I was reading about. Well, this, this, this is another video game, but a uh, different video game. But I was reading about, about Rise of the Triad and, and why why no one like remembers Rise of the Triad quite the way they remember Doom and stuff like that. And uh, it also came out in '94, yeah. right after Doom Two. Might also be why uh, Jazz what didn't. Well, yeah, Jazz, Jazz was popular enough to get a sequel though. Yeah. No, no. I mean, it was sort of a different thing. I yeah. mean, Doom doesn't wasn't really competing with Jazz. Right. The way, like, you know, Rise of the Triad was competing with Doom. True. Was that a flying lobster? Um, it might have been. I think, the, yeah, these are all, like, bugs, because we're in a jungle. Ah, uh, okay, of course. Sort of. I mean, there's more things than bugs in a jungle. Oh, yeah. I, I like how these, um... I, I like how the spike hazards in this world are punching sticks. Ah, uh, yeah. Bringing up... Gem fruit. That worm have a rocket on its back. Yeah. Yes. This is jet lag. <laughs> Everything has a rocket on its back. You'll see, you'll see next episode there's there are slugs with rockets on their backs. Oh wow. Yes. It doesn't really help them. Yeah, I notice the worms or snakes whatever there don't seem to be utilizing the rockets. Oh, I guess they are sort of. I'm sorry, I'm trying to imagine like <laughs> The whole thought process between uh, behind uh, putting a uh, rocket in the back of the Why not? That's, yeah. a, that's a good point. What I, I would imagine is the only real like argument for it. I was pretty proud of that jump I did there. I was like, oh, yeah, just. It's one of the players how unnecessarily, like, <laughs> unnecessarily proud I was of uh, a double jump. A double jump? Double jump. It's an advanced thing. Fine, stuff that little thing that I see in the background, but as soon as I see them, they're gone. Not really good, good luck. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> With those little purple windows in the caves? Yeah. I'm trying to figure out what's going on there. No, those are uh, those little lights. Light. Yeah, you can actually shoot them out. Oh, 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 oh so yeah. you did. Oh, interesting. Those are the only lights like that in the entire game you can shoot out. As far as I'm I'm assuming it doesn't do anything. No. The cursor is a splinter cell. Yeah. You can see all the Articles of Riddick had nothing about this game. You can see all the inspiration. Oh, what are we looking for? I thought there was a secret over there, but I was not. Look at all that purple stuff pouring down out of the 
What was that? Did you guys see that? Yeah. Yeah, I did. One of those. You know any idea what that was supposed to be? That's probably just like the water on this planet. Uh, hey, look at that giant water thing right there. Jump rock. That was a cheap jump. Yeah, yeah right. This game actually has a lot of BS. Like playing through it, I, I realized that this game has a lot, has like a lot of things where you, you jump down and you can't see where you're going. But there's like five enemies there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it might look good when I play it now, but that's because when I'm playing it, I I just finished playing the episode. Right. So like everything I've done is fresh in my mind, and, like all the hazards and stuff, so I know what to look out for. But when I jump in and play, I I I have to have to like use a continue. Although, you know, you don't really use continues in this game, you just get just ask Put another quarter, put yeah. another quarter in your computer. <laughs> yeah. Insert the dollar. Floating plants. Oh. Floating plants. Sure, man. And there were, they're not, they're not here, but that down below there are plants that were literally just floating above the ground. Well, remember, like, way back in episode one, in, on Diamond Dust, there are the, um... Uh, the trees, and there are like mountains on the trees. Like you can see like little silhouettes of mountains and trees on one of the branches. Really? Guess yes. I never noticed that. Weird. I'll put it. I'll put in a little cut thing for the video so you can just do it. Yeah. I'd like to see why just go back and watch. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. So the bag. We're not gonna do anything free. Just go back and watch. Deal with it. Go give us more views on our, on our <laughs> first video. Yeah. Really, I really gem from things. Yeah. Well, they're really they're shiny. Like, yeah, plums. they're very shiny for plums. And what are the yellow ones? Yellow plums? Oh, I guess, yeah. Why didn't I think of that? Little gumball plants. Uh, yeah, that's where the gumballs are. Yeah. What was that? Oh, it was. Rocket Damn rocket snakes. Did we get to fight a boss that wasn't Devin yet? I mean, oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. Okay. Did we it's get to fight one this time? Yes. Right. Is there a place? I thought there was a. Uh, I thought there was a secret, but there wasn't. Ah. Gotta be secret somewhere. That's right. We, we do have a secret oh. somewhere in this in, in this in this uh, episode, right? Oh, there's uh, there's one in the news. No, it'll be in the end. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. So you folks at home stay tuned for that. After this commercial break. Yes. A little smoking gun animation. Yeah. Guardian. I, I, something about the question mark is really bothers me. Huh. That's quite a thing. Is that what yeah. is that, is that supposed to be? It's a lizard, it's I guess. The easiest fucking boss ever. <laughs> wow. Wasn't much to that. No. Tell me about your strategy in that fight. <laughs> I shot it until it died. <laughs> wow. Like a master. Yes. All right. <laughs> Animation out of the best. We all back on the second planet. I kind of like this that friend. No. no. Well, Actually, this game has destructible environments too, huh? Yeah. Looks pretty chill. I'm surprised you didn't show that off in the, in the, uh, the level. <laughs> I forgot. Shit. Those three natural planets are toast. Jazz destroyed their environment. <laughs> Fuck Jazz. Terrible Your uh, scores are getting lower and lower here. Yeah. You falling apart a little? Wait, how, how is 95,000 higher than 146,000? Huh? Yeah, what's oh. going on there? Well, anyway. The episode, um... That actually is in, in order of, uh... In order of, uh, like, uh, score. It's actually in order of planet. Oh, okay. Ow! It's like if, if, oh, so it's like the highest score on the planet. Yeah, or on, oh. the, on the episode rather, right? Okay. Anyway, episode our uh, secrets right here. Go into that little thing. Uh, hold left, 
and go through this little secret passage. Oh. That was actually hard to find, I like the other ones. Yeah. It's kind of buried in there. It was sort of like the, uh, the one in Darkness 2, it was also buried in there. You can very easily miss that one if you don't know what you're looking for. Here's another uh, OMF guy. Oh. This one is the, uh, I believe it's the Shredder. Shredder, Crusher, something to that effect. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> you just said that with like, with like the least oh, interested thing ever. Oh, this is well, I, well, I don't know, I, I don't know anything about that uh, OMF. I played a little bit of it and then I got kind of tired of it, I guess. I liked OMF. I thought it was pretty cool. I liked the, um, like the career mode. Build up your stats and stuff. I, I had always had the impression that that it was it was the most popular fighting game on, on for DOS by merit of being the only fighting game on DOS. Yeah. Were there other fighting games on DOS? There had to be. Uh, I mean, there was uh, Street Street Fighter Two was ported to DOS. Oh yeah. I, I had was, I, I had that. Yeah. I heard that <laughs> was that? terrible. Yeah. When I was a kid, it was good enough for me, I and mean, I didn't really know the difference at the time, I guess. Right. But uh, all right, well, thanks for watching, folks. Yeah. yeah. Later. See you later.